Hi, this video is to help you understand exactly what it means when something is a linear function. So a lot of students, um, you know, don't, don't really know exactly what differentiates a, a linear function from, from some other kind of function when they're in their algebra or algebra two class. So I'll tell you what makes a function linear is that it's of the form y equals mx plus b. So a linear function would be something like um, f of x equals mx plus b. So let's give some examples here. Uh, it might be f of x equals 4x plus 2. That would be in um, oops, plus 2. This would be in mx plus b form. Another example might be f of x equals 3 halves x minus 7. So notice here I can see my m term is 3 halves. My uh, x is just x, it's nothing else. And that's really what makes it linear is that x is, is just x. And my b term would be minus 7. So what might help you better understand what a linear function is, is to see some things that are not linear functions. So something that isn't a linear function might be f of x equals 2x squared plus 7. Anytime x has any exponent other than 1, it is not a linear function. So f of x equals you know, 4x to the 7th minus 2 would also not be a linear function. What else cannot be a linear function? Well, maybe something that's like the square root of x. So maybe we had f of x equals the square root of x, whoops, square root of x plus 3. That would also not be linear because, well, the square root of x is, is not x. It's the square root of it. What else might not be? Uh, if you have x in the denominator, maybe you had 1 over x minus 7. This would not be linear as well. Um, notice for all of these, I'm putting them in y equals mx plus b form. Uh, you don't necessarily have to do that. I'll show you how you can tell if it's linear in standard form. Uh, but it is uh, good practice to be able to convert anything to y equals mx plus b form. I think that's the most useful um, form is, is slope intercept form y equals mx plus b. Uh, what else would not be linear? Anything with any of your trig functions. So like sine of x would not be linear. f of x equals tangent of x. That would not be linear. Um, or maybe f of x equals uh, log of x. That would be logarithmic. So you can see here that it's, you know, un unless it really looks like this y equals mx plus b, uh, or you, you need to have y to the first or f of x to the first somewhere. And in x to the first, and no square roots, no x in the denominator, no sine, no tangent, no, no none of that, because that would make it nonlinear. So all of these are not linear functions. So I hope that I hope that clears up uh, for you what what a linear function is and what it is not. More importantly.